I don't know. I think I hit a uh, few. You know, you got a few easy looks early. Hit a couple at the rim. You know, already had a good rhythm mid first quarter. And um, felt like I should have had 10 threes, but you never let, you know, missed shots affect you. Just keep being aggressive. Unfortunately, I didn't have very many assists, but that happens. Third quarter, it looked like you kind of went into that zone where everything you throw up is going in. Did you sense that? Did you feel that? And what's that like? Uh, a little bit. Um, I just thought I was getting good shots. I was in a good rhythm to start the game. Have been these last few games. And uh, what it's like, I mean, it's the best feeling on a basketball court, especially when you propel your team to a win when you get in one of those zones. So they don't happen very often. So when you do, when you do enter them, you try to just stay in them as long as you can. And, get great looks every time down the floor. Sounds like you guys now kind of have a target return date or area for DeMarcus later this month. How, it, you know, how good is that for you guys to finally have, you know, maybe a known runway leading up to, to getting him back? It's exciting. I know our fan base is excited. NBA is excited. I can't wait to integrate him with our team. He has a whole new dimension, especially on the block. He's such a handful down there. And his ability to play make. So I'm excited to get DeMarcus back. He's going to be He's been great in the rehab process. I commend him for you know sticking with it. That's, that people don't realize how hard that is to do, to just come in every day and not see an end point, but just try and work to get healthy. He's been so mature about it, and I can't wait to get out there with him on the floor. I've been blessed to play with him with Team USA. I've seen him close to person, how good he is, and he can will you to wins. Clay, a lot was made over the slump. You know, you're in December, a little bit in uh, November. Do you think you were due for one of these kind of games? Every night I feel like I'm due for one of these kind of games, believe it or not. But uh, uh, to me, it wasn't that big of a deal to miss, you know, not hit my career marks of whatever field goal percentage, whatever it was, because I know how long the season is. I've been doing this for eight years now, and I know there's going to be ups and downs. And uh, you want to be at your best when your best is needed. And although I feel like it's needed every night, we still have a lot more important games ahead of us. Clay, to that point, you guys are at the halfway mark of the season now, but how do you balance knowing that you got a lot more games, hopefully, to play uh, after that? Uh, well, every game we have an Oracle is a blessing because it's the last time we get to play here, believe it or not. It's hard to fathom, so every time we run out on this court just to you know give it our all. And um, I mean, just enjoy the ride. Uh, We've been doing this, trying to win a championship, or realistically trying to win a championship for the last four years. So these don't last forever. These dynasties are the opportunity to cement ourselves as a dynasty. So every night is special, and especially playing in front of a crowd like we have. We're sold out every night, and that is a rare feat. So we're just lucky to be in this position. Clay, what significance would you attach if any of uh, all the All-Stars being able to get in the World Series and then considering the close games that you guys had recently that required a lot of them? Wait, what's that? What, what significance do you put in the, the All-Stars having the you know, below 30 minutes tonight after all those close games that required a little bit more? It was a, it was a nice thing to be a part of. It's been a while since we had a blowout. We've been in some close games the last month, and uh, I think more games like this are coming, especially as guys get healthy, we get to mark his back. But um, it was just a fun night to be a part of, obviously, winning big by big margin has been rare. We, we haven't done it as much as we should this season, but I think halfway point, you know, we're, we're in a very good position. We're you know, on pace for 54 from five wins. I think that could increase, and I think it will. Just, uh, just gotta enjoy this last run of Oracle.